the Scarlet Star, as punishment for its betrayal, is chased from the heavens by the Twelve Celestials. That ill-fated star is known as the Firebringer. This god, the Wicked One, gave man the gift of fire. stories come to an inglorious end, thwarted by the whims of the shattered Firebringer. Heroes, cling to your ambitions. You know, I kind of miss good intros. I didn't really do like pre-menu intros anymore like they used to. Here, let me turn it down a little. There we go. I don't do pre-game intros anymore. Which is a shame, because I always liked them. They always did a really good job of setting the tone. I liked that one too. Like it's not my favorite style of music, but it was still a good song. This is a good song, too. The Saga series <laughs> has its ups and downs, let's say. I have played them all, and honestly, I probably dislike more of them than I like. Like, I like the ones that are more open-ended. I love Saga Frontier, Romancing Saga 3. The first Romancing Saga I played, but it was the PS2 remake. I honestly did not like the PS2 remake. Simply because, like, it felt very overwhelming to play. I feel like if I had actually played the original Super Nintendo version, or if they did a Pixel remaster now, I would probably enjoy it. But I just didn't like the menus, I didn't like the way it was constructed. I don't know if it was a remake or what, but I didn't like Chromancing Saga 1. I feel like I would have if I had played the original though. Or again, a new Pixel Remaster. Which that is the only game they haven't Pixel Remastered. Or be released. Every other Saga game is available on Switch now. Literally all of them. You can get the Game Boy games on Switch now. They have not released Romancing Saga 1. Which is weird. You can even get this on Switch, which is where I'm playing it. Now I'm aware this was originally a mobile game. It was made for phones. 
So I'm not expecting anything too spectacular. But I mean, it's a saga RPG. It doesn't need it to be like heavy graphics or anything like that to be well designed. I'm a little disappointed there's only four playable characters apparently. But I am excited if there are multiple playable characters. Because the ones with single playable characters tend to be the ones that I don't like. Like, Romantic Saga 2 starts with that thing where... It's some weird gimmick in Romantic Saga 2. I don't even know what it's about. Or Saga Frontier 2. The ones that just try to take away the open-ended aspect and the choices I don't like much. But the ones that do give you a character and let you, like, explore the world. Those are the Saga games that I like. That's what it, this looks like. And if that's what it's doing, then I'm okay, a okay with that. I at least want to give it a good try. So let's see. Many stories you have previously cleared. Oh. Um. Oh, this is interesting. I can like toggle the clears. I mean, that saves them from having to. Okay, I can think I like this though. Because in the other Saga games, if you want to. It takes a long time to beat every story, let's put it that way. And if you lose your save data somehow, you have to start all over. This way, like, not only does it save them from having to keep, like, a master save file. But if I lose my saves somehow, I can start over and just say, Oh yeah, I've already cleared Upina and Taria. And then it's no big deal. I have not actually played the game before though, so not cleared. Across the board. <laughs> These selections cause events involving characters you have cleared the game with to occur. Their contents may be confusing for players who have not finished those character stories. So we recommend answering honestly. Marking a story as cleared has no impact on game difficulty and yields no special items or other such bonuses. Uh, everyone's not clear. Did you pay attention? The Emperor's coastal vanguard has set sail. What draws your eye? It's beautiful figurehead. I have an eye for beauty. Fireworks dance in the sky. Beautiful yet ephemeral. What do you feel as you watch them? True beauty is fleeting. <laughs> Rules have meaning because people follow them, yet occasionally the strong try to break them. Uh, hmm. Rules exist to restrain the strong. Which you prefer, an orderly, impoverished world or a chaotic, rich one? Ooh. Rich world, hell yeah. Give me that chaos, baby. You till the land, flood the field, plant the seeds, care for the plants, and harvest the crop. What have you gained? The bounty of the land. Where are we going with this? Your next foe is a fierce one. What preparations do you make to ensure victory? <laughs> I mean, both are true. Can't fight an empty stomach. <laughs> Your castle is under siege. You haven't eaten for days. What do you most desire after you emerge victorious? A supreme feast! Oh, is that the character selection? Alright, the music's fairly loud, apparently. Starting region, Markiam Yaxart. Your typical tough guy. Leonard is a man who prefers action to words. 
Those not put off by his harsh demeanor find themselves with a staunch ally through thick and thin. Um, okay, I'll take it. I'll need to grow up fast if I'm gonna drown the Scarlet Shards and I hand him. I'll need to grow up fast if I'm gonna drown the Scarlet Shards and I hand him. I'll need to grow up fast if I'm gonna drown the Scarlet Shards and I hand him. I'll need to grow up fast if I'm gonna drown the Scarlet Shards and I hand him. So one is deadpan and one is emotional? Those are the options? That is a weird option to give me. Like maybe that's their way of saying, oh, here's one actor and here's another actor, but that is... I'll need to grow up fa I'll need to grow up fast if I'm gonna drown the Scarlet Shards and I hand him. I'll need to grow up fast if I'm gonna drown the Scarlet Shards and I hand him. This kind of sounds bored. <laughs> Alright, I guess I'll go with default, just for the default experience. <laughs> that makes sense to me. Yes. Leonard. Alright, auto save icon. Did the VA really give two performances of every line? I don't know. I don't know if it's the same VA or what, but. Yeah, apparently one is like this and one is like this! <laughs> it's battle dialogue, so. It's probably only like five battle lines. It was originally a mobile game, so it can't be that expressive. Anusia Farm. Alright, that ought to do it for the harvest. I'm gonna be top dog again this year for sure. Go to Ihanum. Are all of his poses like supermodel poses? He always like one hand on the hip, one in his hair. He looks like he's like doing a supermodel pose and on stage somewhere. Whoa, you okay, lady? He looks like a supermodel, See, actually. The Scarlet Shards. Hey, are you alright? Drown them in Ihanim. Oh man, hang in there, lady. Come on. I'd better take her to the clinic. She doesn't seem to be hurt, but she's incredibly weak. I doubt she'll be able to move about for a while yet. She told me to drown the Scarlet Shards and I Hanan. Leonard, this shard has a different shape from the one you were born holding. Enough with all the stories, Doc. I didn't even buy them when I was a kid. Wait, born holding? Ow! Poor mom! Ugh. Seriously, what kind of baby is born clutching a rock like this? It's the truth, lad. And I would know, because I was the one who delivered you. Fine. You are Have not that fun. old. See if I care. Is this lady gonna be okay or what? All we can do is let her rest for now. She most certainly won't be making any journeys to I Hanum. Still not awake, huh? No, but her breathing stabilized overnight, and her color is also improved. Doc, I need you to take care of her for me. I'm gonna make that journey in her place. Her journey? What? Why must you do this? She said she was trying to get to I Hanum. She basically entrusted me with her mission, so now I'm gonna find it in her place. That's really all there is to it. <laughs> like how he didn't even come up with an excuse to do this. Like, he might as well have just gone, I mean, I'm the game protagonist. Of course I have to do literally everything anyone says needs to be done. That is how video games work, don't you know that? How very Leonard-like of you. But you have enough money to be traveling the world. A penniless farm boy like you can't very well wander the land on nothing but his pluck. 
Mr. Adams paid to rent my fields on the condition they become his if I don't ever come back. He seemed mighty happy with the deal, too. Had a slop-eaten grin on his face a mile wide. Paid to rent my fields on the condition they become his if I don't ever come back. That seems like a very weird deal. Like... <laughs> He's paying you, and if you die, he just keeps it. How do you benefit from that part of the deal? Like, what? I mean, I guess it won't matter to you if you're dead, so... I mean, it make th I guess it makes sense. I fear you're getting in over your head. Yet, see, there's nothing I can do to stop it. Do you have even the slightest clue where this Ihanum place is? Nope. Why am I not surprised? In that case... Make for the Imperial Library in Oswa Khan. If your answers cannot be found there, they likely cannot be found at all. Thanks, Doc. You're the best egghead I know. I know it's pointless for me to say this, but please don't do anything reckless. Leo, where do you think you're going? Hey, Lissa. I'm headed to I Hanum. Funny, I thought you were headed to donate yourself to the Idiot Museum. You wanna know where I Hanum is? It's in this picture book. I hate to ruin the surprise, but it's not real. I probably saved us about 10 hours of game time, her just telling us that. This is none of your business. Besides, shouldn't she be off getting married so Mr. Adams can stop worrying about it? That's none of your business. And you even borrowed money from my father. Unbelievable. Come here, you two. What's with you? And why are you just standing there? Don't you have jobs? Lissa just dragged us here. Leonard, you can't just go off on a journey all by your lonesome. I know it's a hassle, but let us come with you. Ugh, fine. Do whatever you want. Hey, you do not get to tell me what to do. Only I get to tell me what to do, got it? Now zip that lip and let's get this stupid train to Stupidville on the road already. I can tell she's gonna be pleasant. In that case, we're going to the Imperial Library in Oswakan. Book learning, eh? Oh, aren't we fancy? Anyway, that means we need to go through Rosui Tower and into Provincia K. As much as I'm poking fun at the writing, the acting is not that bad. Like, aside from the very deadpan battle quotes that are apparently coming, yeah, the, di the spoken dialogue is not bad. It's not great, but it's not bad. Okay. It's faster along roads. Retinue? Wait, where'd you come from? <laughs> I didn't even see you! You weren't in the cutscene! So we start with the full party. Alright. Armaments? Where's armaments? Equipment. Okay. Text. Oh, is this like... No, it's per weapon. It's like it's more Saga Frontier 2 style. Maybe? Text with a light bulb have a possibility of being glimmered if you fight barehanded. not acquired. Okay, so I guess they're red if you know what the tech is. Is that how it works? I 
Takes a light ball if it possibly glimmer from the current weapon. Okay. I think I'm figuring it out. Whoa! Where'd you come from? Going up here in Casper? I have a lot of characters following me. Jeez. Rolls. Dexterity up M. Intelligence up M. Of course, everyone wants to fight for her. The chance to be targeted up a uh, contrarian. Everyone hates a contrarian. Just be targeted up. HP up. Paralysis recovery up. Paralysis resistance up. Astute lass. Initial position up. Chance to be targeted up. Text and incantations required for roll? Okay, this is gonna take some getting used to. Let's see. Oh! Huh. A town adjacent to a lake, both of which are named Rasui. So, how are you doing today, Iron Chef? Have a good day, I hope. Smithies can reforge armaments in your possession into new ones. Order requires materials and can be found as spoils throughout the world. Only a limited number of opportunities to receive new equipment. So I recommend that you take full advantage of the Smithies services. Really? New equipment is rare, huh? Pilgrimage site dedicated to Dimazu, the celestial of sea voyages. You don't need to go here right now. Can I go there? Non engagement events. We're going to the Imperial Library, right? Okay. So I have to find my way there. Some claim this is the first flame of the Firebringer. The forbidden point. It's our first time here. This is the new tribe's turf. Apparently they never enter here and they hate it when anyone else does. Man, this place is Dullsville. Well, except for that giant fire burning in the middle over there. And that's the undying flame. You're not supposed to take it out of here, because if it ever started a fire, you couldn't put it out. Shrine, Bartlett Shrine. Oh, you can run, nice. Okay, where is the... Also, Pilgrim's Site from Morgan. Can I just go to Provincia K? Oh. Where is it? Um, okay. You don't need to go here right now. This appears to be a nest of fiends. Wait. Certain landmarks in the world map can lead to combat engagements. Interacting with these landmarks will make up a list of rewards. Any foes you haven't faced will appear as silhouettes. I'll see the bonus rewards and the conditions for receiving them. Commence engagement. Okay. Notification will display on the top left part of the screen when a new team has been added, new term has been added to the test menu. Refer to the test menu and need help securing victory in battle or otherwise finding a way around the world. Steps can be viewed via the menu at any time, be it on the world map or during combat. Alright, I guess this team is fine. I want to see what battle's like. Because apparently the game seems okay, but I actually do own Unlimited Saga. 
Unfortunately. And the battle system was where the game absolutely fell the hell apart. I'm hoping that doesn't happen here. During engagement, the first thing you do is select a character to act with left stick left and left stick right. Next, select a tech to use, left up and down. Finally, to confirm your command A. Oh gosh, I'm so out of my way. Oh gosh, I'm so excited. Out of my way. What am I even doing here? Ugh, what Wait. pain. The characters attack in whatever order I want? I've got your back. The bottom of the screen displays the order in which all of his foes will act in combat. Oh, the first act is on the left. With characters acting later, the further to the right they appear. Imagine how excited she would be with the expressive voices, yeah. I'm not sure if that only affects his voice or everyone's voices. Probably everyone's, I guess. Tech and incantation effects can alter this order. Oh, okay. So that doesn't affect the where you're gonna attack next turn, attacks where you attack where you do this turn. So if I do this, her torn order actually moves up to the left. I got you. Oh no, it doesn't. Oh no, it moves to the right. I see, because it takes longer to charge, I guess. Because here she attacks second, here she attacks third. Okay, I'm seeing how it works. Oh, this thing isn't dead yet. Man, she is slow. How many stars do I have left? Three? I want to stop it from moving. Wait. Oh. Oh, I see what I did. Alright, Roundhouse is fine, I guess. Oh, I see what it's doing! So it's not- I'm not really changing the order of- Oh, he's asleep. Okay. Can't use him. Not really changing the order here, I'm just jumping across the timeline to give orders to each character. I see how that's working. I've got it. And punch. Braveheart roll. Rewards Unda Crystal. Oh, we're still going, I guess. Oh, uh -huh. Uh, engage, I guess. 
Hopefully everyone's HP. Does anyone HP recover? I can't tell. Yeah, okay, everyone's healed. So basically just everyone focus on one target, like, you know, like it's obvious. this one before it does anything. This one's mine. You're cruising for a cruising. Huh? What did they just do? It only says it's a unite attack. We'll have the BP cost of our text and incantations reduced in the next round. This greatly expands your options the following round and opens up strategies that are previously unavailable. In some cases, incantation casting time may reduce as well. Okay, but how did they unite? They didn't even do anything. Is that Was that what united them? They're standing around and not actually accomplishing anything? Or they united in laziness? Is that what it was? I guess they were. Just in case. Ding! Ding! Time for some fun. Did you see that just now? These enemies have a lot of health. Hey, I did it. Oh, okay. Do what I can. Down swing. Pongs. Leo, you all right? Increase your defense. I want everyone to get in here and attack. A shot. Smash. I don't even know how to use items. Damage. Oh, she's down. Quit messing with us. Paralyzing Get seems together, good. Lisa. I'm up, huh? Lord. Hey, it's paralyzed. Nice. Well, I got focused in on the dead body. I just say it's a dragon spider. What the most horrifying creature I've ever heard of. Oh, nice. Paralysis just stops it from doing anything. Uh, thank you would be nice. We won, yeah? Cool. <laughs> That's one way to say it. Make it easier, right? I think I'd rather be taller if that's cool. Okay. 
I mean, I don't mind, but good luck with that. Oh, I didn't get the B-side. Whatever. But the beasts have dispersed. Okay, so it's Mystic Quest style. It's Final Fantasy Mystic Quest. You go in specific caves to fight enemy gauntlets. I haven't seen that since Mystic Quest. That's interesting. Here's me a nest of fiends. Celestial of Medicine. You don't need to go here right now. The town contains a large number of smiths. You receive a dress sword as a gift for visiting Stahl. Okay. You specialize in use of Prisma, Terra, and Unda crystals. You don't need as many for our work. I just got some Unda crystals, so yay. But what is this sword I just got? Sword. Ornate Rapier. Type special. Smithy rank. Is that 11 or 2? I think that's 2. Okay, yeah, it is going by Roman numerals. It's 2. Regional goods. Wait, how do I equip people? And who is using single swords? You? I think he is. I don't know what she's using. I've been adulting for a while now. Okay. She's a mage. I do like I do like using mages. Maybe I'll put her in the team. Looks like a question mark. I'm like, what does the question mark mean? All right. There we go. Mage. Brawler. Seems okay. What do you use as single swords, though? Makes it. I guess I can switch someone to a sword. Can you use a sword? No, he's supposed to be a brawler, but I think he can use a sword. Swords. Oh, I can improve this one. Needed 27. Ooh, wow. Ooh. Wait. Oh, each bow has its own glimmers. Okay, wait, I'm not sure what the needed is doing. 
Because Nita says 30, 227, and I have 29. So does that mean it'll take 27? Or I'll have 27 left afterwards, and it only takes three. One way to find out. At least we think have a forte for a particular element. So this is that require fewer materials than the elements that matches their forte. No, that took 27. The blacksmiths of Stahl excel at handling Prisma, Unda, and Terra crystals. Right, well, I have a better bow, at least. I'll take it. Upgrade her frying pan. Oh. Auxiliary armor. Where is this town I'm supposed to go to? Holy crap, where is it? Am I supposed to go through like a passage? He's Marcin Margassi. That's the fiends. I think it's only one battle. Might as well do it. Beat the final foe with Unite Attack. Ooh, bunch of enemies. Why don't you come and get me? Beat a target with your staff, increasing your focus. <laughs> I just upgraded her bow. Let's see her do something. Lot of damage to her. Why does that say two? Oh, it attacks everyone. Nice. Well, oh, only he can punch now. Even I can get these? Oh, it takes two turns. That's what it means. Get your act together. Wow, that's a long casting time. And aim shot. Dead by the time she casts it. Oh, no! Ooh, you'll pay for that. I have left over a thing. Let's use your shiver smash. Then punch, then smash. I mean, that's good news, I guess. It means she's not taking up stars while she's charging. Ram it. I didn't even get to see the spell. <laughs> what are you looking at? Learned the, the strong roll. X 
Recess Terra Flux wells forth. Huh? Flux appears after successful engagement with at least one ally in your active battle revenue has a staff equipped. The type of flux that appears is linked to the elemental affinity of the battlefield, and only one ally may absorb it. Um, tips for glimmering. Minuscule chance to glimmer an incantation of the A's element. Siren absorbs the divine energies of the flux. Okay. This is a den for mangy thieves, but they have dispersed. There's a world map. Maybe I should consult the world map. I forgot where we're going. It was... Provincia K? Was that it? I think it was. So we need to go uh, up here, maybe? Or over here. Yeah, up here, I think. I can't go that way. You should go to Provincia K. I'm trying. Probably need to go through here. The K border is blocked, so it is. No getting through. I need to go to Azuakan. Let me through. Did you not hear me? No getting through. Did you not hear me? Let me through. Gods, enough already, Leo. You'd have better luck arguing with a brick wall. Come on, let's go. This lady's bugging me. Oi! Don't talk about me like I ain't here. I wonder why we can't go through. I hear there's been lots of fighting and whatever in K recently. Huh, I didn't know you followed that kind of stuff, Lisa. My father told me about it. Said doing business with Castle Kohan over in K has been getting super difficult. What's he gonna do about it? He said something about using the mountain pass to Megadasi. Or Megdas. It's a pretty roundabout route. He didn't have much choice otherwise. Yes, that means we don't either. Come on, let's head that way. Okay, I have a destination. But. I feel like there's benefits to fighting all the battles. Dream Masher. Why are they glowing? Does that mean they're strong here? see the spell actually go off. That's what I want. Basically, the idea is, yeah, it definitely feels like a mobile game, I'll say that. No, it's a very creative mobile game. Yeah, there was no reason to use that spell. 
Look, man, I'm beat. How exactly did I improve? Toys are weak against. I didn't even read that. All right. Oh, okay, cool. So, did she just fight with a frying pan the entire game? Receive a ring of Fay as a gift for visiting Twi. All right. As cheap as the static images are, I kind of dig the graphics. I like the style. Do. I assume it counts as an armament. Blessed by the Precocious. Increases mobile and endurance and decreases acuity. I don't know what acuity is. It's definitely better than Unlimited Saga, I'll say that. It's because the battle system seems to function properly. This passage leads to Markium Magdasi. Right. Is where I'd be going, or what? I mean, yeah. Oh, we're just here now. Okay. Scarlet Shard is... Shining? What does that mean? Use the Scarlet Shard from the menu, such as the belongings, key items. Will do! There is a new and born holy. Oh, huh. That, Lissa? It looked like a shooting star that fell to Earth. An illusion from the Scarlet Shard, I guess. Where are we anyway? Um, Markium Megdase, the province next door? Sheesh, I swear you'd forget your own head if I wasn't around to remind you to bring it. Wait, this is Megdase? Leo. Please don't tell me this is the first time you've ever stepped foot outside Yaxart. Yeah. Seriously? Ooh, wow. Man, it took real guts to say you want to go all the way to Ihanum. Hey, everyone has firsts. Something wrong with that? It's just... Well, I guess I'm speechless. And that does not happen often. Is there actually something up here? A tree! Apple tree. These pitch black apples are disliked by the people of the region. A black apple? You don't see those in Yaxart. They look ripe. 
I'll pick them. They're way too light. The whole batch is bad. Which is not a good reason to try and sneak a bite. So don't even think about it. They're a weird color. Also a weird smell. That might have been a bad idea, but that's what I did. What would you see if you were to claim it? That's why they're famous. They form big drawings. This one's an animal. I'm glad you finally took the time to appreciate a little culture, Leo. Yeah, I guess so. Still, the guy who did this must have had a ton of free time. Actually, I bet even I could do this if I had the time. It's uneven here, too. I'm just going to smooth this out a little bit. Hey, stop doing that! They're going to be in super big trouble if anyone finds out that you're running around racing the famous Spigdas Glyphs. Kai Cow Quarters? Converse! Hmm. What's that a picture of? That is the Beast King, guardian of the Kaikau people themselves. The Beast King is in the middle of a deep, long sleep. The warm blood of a fresh kill is required to wake him, but it will take a great deal of blood to satisfy him. Spacious Pasture? All manner of people gather in town plazas. Visit them every so often to see if anyone is there to provide you with information or services. Listen to the fable I tell. Okay. Gather round, friend, and I shall spin a tale passed from lip to ear across the world entire. The apple tree is native to Megdas, and yields fruit both red and black. The red is nutritious yet tastes foul, while the black has no value, yet tastes like divine food of the celestials. The Megdas nomads speak of the black fruit's secrets. They say it turns from red to black whenever it sucks up the blood of the infernals that slumber inside the earth. But it's already black. Therefore do nomads name the black fruit's taboo, for they believe that any who eats one will have their soul claimed by an infernal. You, however, are no nomad. I wonder if you would have the courage to attempt the black apple. Is this story true? None alive can say. Something's wrong if a red fruit turns black. No way you'll get me to eat one. Something from another character, perhaps? Oh, you just build... Oh, I see. You just build new equipment. Okay. I don't really have anything. Yeah, I'm totally good with letting him sleep. Oh, for sure. Letting who sleep? What did I do? I mean, the earth exploded. I've got to at least see what that was. What is that hole? Okay, I can't do anything with it, so...
Oh, it's easy. Nice. Don't let any allies get knocked out. I wonder how I recover LP. I don't see any ends or anything. Me off. can just not use him for anything? Oh, I can't use him. Come here, random due to confusion. Oh, I see! Okay. Wait, is he still using my stars? Shot that pierces one foe. Oh, basic. Okay, so you can just do that. Kill it, kill it immediately. Nice. Abilities are going up. They vandalize. Thunder of Target and Twain. When did I learn that? Did I just learn it? I missed it? So how do you learn new magic? I guess he needs to know those abilities. Kind of doesn't, though. Let's demonstrate physical attack damage up and strength up. Oh, you can have multiple rolls eventually. Oh, okay. Yeah, that's a strong. Okay. why they're famous. They form big drawings. It's a bird. Yeah, yeah, a little culture. Follow me quarters. Hold! You're no Megdas nomad. What's your business here? I'm looking for I Hanum. Think you can confuse me with stories, lad? That's it. You're coming with me. Who are you, and what is your business here? 
I'm looking for Ihanam. Stop making me repeat myself. That is a city from the Cradle Tales, yes? Are you perhaps dreaming? I'm not dreaming. I'm really looking for it. You know anything about it? I know only that there was once a city called Ihanam, whose people were so arrogant that the Celestials saw fit to destroy them. Yeah, I already know about that story. It's not the Ihanam I'm looking for. I see. Well, there's no likely no harm in letting you wander around Magdas. I'm heading east now, but I pray you find your Ihanam. Farewell. Why did that guy have such a stick up his butt? That was King Adil of the Walamir, you know. He conquered all the other tribes and is now the big cheese here in Megdas. I can't believe he took the time to talk to someone like you. A king, eh? Right on. Ooh, he's using those apples, huh? You think they want these apples? They don't have much heft, but they're better than nothing. Hmm. I want to feed the sheep the apples. See if they get cursed. Man, these sheep must have been crazy hungry to be so happy about apples like those. Is your shepherd been doing his job? Oi! You can't just give my sheep food like that! Buy a cell! Look how big they got! They are blocking the sheep with my characters. What do you know? They must have been full of nutrients after all. What in blazes did you feed my sheep? Well, you're the one who started this mess. So you get out there and take care of it. And that fiends taste disgusting. I mean, I doubt you're wrong. Charging the magic. Hopefully, the maximum number of stars goes up a bit. Tapping the fire out of the screen. Yeah, they didn't even bother trying to change the like tool tips and stuff. Bone crusher. Classic. Did that hurt? It's just happening now. Jeez. I hope all this growth doesn't give me wrinkles. Attack. Nice. Observation tower collapsed. Tower's already become a den for fiends. Easy, easy, normal. New quarters. Receive a power belt as a gift for visiting new quarters. 
What's that a picture of? That is Grusoni. A sacred flower to us new. The Grusoni blooms but once every thousand years. We offer up our prayers to this glyph of it. They say the Grusoni will bloom if given a water droplet from each of the three caves nearby. Many have ventured to the caves, but none have ever, ever, none have ever been able to collect the droplets. Are there fiends in the caves? No, but the droplets can only be gathered once every thousand years. Terra crystals, eh? Formation of Lake Magdas. Filling its basin to the brim with water. Like irrigation, okay. Giant plant. Man, this is this Grusoni is massive. That's awesome. Alright. Oh, these must be the caves with the water in it. I see. So if I do this, it's probably like a side quest thing. I'm curious enough to see if I can do it. Hard. But it's only one battle. Normal. Easy. Let's start with this. I'm just confused with the target, disrupting its actions. Aim for United Attacks in the timeline shows a foe located between allies. Anguishing the foe in the middle yield United Attack. Uh huh? Oh! Okay, so if I kill this thing here. They will just pummel the crap out of the last one on the left, on the far right. If I'm seeing this correctly. Let's see if that's correct. I was wondering what was triggering them. So strong. We did it. That is it. Okay. to the bone again. Man, I can't believe this droplet waited a thousand years just for us to stop by. Don't be silly. This does mean the f we can see the flower. Get this thing open and I think I'll call it a day there.
Did you see that just now? Oh man, typical. Yeah. Warthogs with engines in their butts always do that. What the hell? Alright, I do want to confuse something probably. Of course. It's your damage. I don't know why I thought that might work. Do you know what you just did? Oh, I had two extra stars. I could have. Uh... So strong. Get back. Vandalize. The punch should kill the one that's moving. Did you see that just now? Yeah. Can I really go first? How exactly did I improve? This droplet waited a thousand years. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You know what would be kind of cool? Well, terrible and kind of cool. If the LP was just straight up limited. And the game was like we need to take this seriously the game just went okay your characters run out of LP they're like actually dead now you have to switch to another another character in your party and that's why you start with so many characters I think that'd be a very interesting mechanic if I don't get to see it in action, I need to look it up and see if that's how it is. That'd be kind of cool. I like that idea. Wait, no. I want to the siren. Typical. 
Didn't we suck anyway, honestly. Oh, I think I see what's happening there. The death is bringing a couple of characters closer together. You'll pay for that. Increase attack power. That seems good. I'll do what I can. I'm up, huh? Crusher. If you're injured, get back. Downsizing. That's fine. Help us do everything around here. Oh, that's it. Look, man, I'm beat. Where am I? Wait, who am I? Should I really be this strong? to go. So you learn some new spell now? Oh, not quite yet. I went to this droplet with a thousand years. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I just wanted to see what this is. Bloom? Bloom, baby! Okay. Pollen? <laughs> and nectar! Sticky, gross nectar! Ugh! It's attracting butterflies. to be quite fond of humans. Where are we going, butterflies? Oh, they're following me. Okay. Uh, I need to take them somewhere? I was trying to chase them. It turned out they were just following. Uh... I just have butterfly friends now. <sighs> this is just a wasteland. No lines making pictures here. I 
can go that way. I wanted to like, find out what these butterflies do. Alright. I'm gonna call up for today. I'm getting tired. Ugh. Thank you for joining me, Iron Chef. I will be back at some point, probably tomorrow. I don't know if I'll be playing this. It seems like an interesting game, but... Yeah, I'm not sure. I just got it on... Because I've never played this one, this particular Saga game. And it was on a very steep Switch sale. So if anyone's actually interested in it, you can pick it up for a pretty low price right now. Or you can just get, figure out how to get it on mobile, I guess. Is it available for modern phones? I don't even know. If it is, that's an option, I guess. But yeah, I will be back later. Later. <laughs>